and there's bad weather of a different sort headed our way. A solar storm has sent out a flare that's headed to Earth, and get this, at a speed of 1.6 million, 1.6 million kilometers an hour. It's expected to hit the Earth's magnetic field sometime today. As Eagle News correspondent Ron Hamilton tells us, the solar flare could disrupt various communications platforms. Most of us who use mobile devices will need to be patient in the next day or two, as the solar flare is due to hit the Earth and is expected to disrupt both cellular and radio signals. NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory captured this latest event and was immediately classified as an X-class eruption, the most powerful type of solar flare. This latest phenomenon is the biggest of its kind since 2017 when an X 8.2 event was recorded. Solar flares are large eruptions of electromagnetic radiation from the sun, lasting from minutes to hours. The sudden outburst of electromagnetic energy travels at the speed of light. Therefore, any effect upon the sunlit side of the Earth's exposed outer atmosphere occurs at the same exact time as the event is observed. The increased level of X-ray and extreme ultraviolet radiation results in ionization in the lower layers of the ionosphere on the sunlit side of the Earth, causing high-frequency radio signals to become degraded or completely absorbed. This results in a radio blackout, the absence of HF communication, primarily impacting the 3 to 30 megahertz band. Solar flares usually take place in active regions, which are areas of the sun marked by the presence of strong magnetic fields typically associated with sunspot groups. Reporting from Honolulu, Hawaii, this is Ron Hamilton with Eagle News. We live in interesting times.